In this video, we are going to do two pages from the book Little Thinker English and the pages are 39 and page number 40. Let's do page number 39 from the book Little Thinker English and what we are going to do. I will read the instruction for you. Fill in the blanks with the correct words from the story. I hope you all have read the story Varsha the firefighter again and again. So it will be very easy for us to fill in the blanks. Okay, let's begin. I look then one blank, two blank, three blank for my fire engine. You can see the image and where is she looking? She is looking mm -hmm, under the bed, right? And the sentence which is there on the page, you can see the page in inset and we are going to write those three words. So, we will write after I look, then we are going to write Under my bed. So let us read the entire sentence once. I look under my bed for my fire engine. Now, let us come to the next sentence. Let us read the words which are already given there. There are one blank, then another blank, then fire engines. Look at the image. So, what can you see here? <laughs> what can you see in this image? The sentence is talking about fire engines, right? And there are, these two words are already given there. How many fire engines can you see? So, that number name will come here. So, we will write here. Four. And then, after four, we are going to write the color of the fire engines. What's the color of the fire engines? I know. You all know this answer. The word will be red. So let us read the sentence. There are four red fire engines. You can see in this image. Now let us read the last sentence. We write in the then there is a blank. So, tell me which word will come here. You can see a vehicle here. So, what do you feel? What will come here? We write in the... Yes, your guess is right. We are going to write here. Car. So, let us read the sentence. We write in the car. And one more thing, when you are doing this page, don't forget to write today's date in the top left corner. We are going to do page number 40 from Little Thinker English book. What we are going to do? Let me read the instruction for you. Write yes or no to the questions given. Let us read the sentence for you. Then you can understand. Renu's toy is bigger than the fire engine. Do you think it is so? Renu's toy, this toy is bigger than the fire engine? Not at all. So which answer will come here? The answer will be 
No, very good. We are going to write like this. Capital N and small o. No. Let us move to the next one. The sentence is, There is a fire at the market. Look at the page. Which sentence is written there? There is a fire at the market. So, what we are going to write? Yes or no? We are going to write yes here. Y capital E and S. Yes. Third sentence. Renu wants to be a firefighter. You have read the story. Tell me, is this true or false? Are we going to write yes to this sentence or no? The answer is going to be yes because actually Renu wants to be a firefighter. So here we are going to write yes. Capital Y, E and then S. Yes. Now we are going to come to the second part of this page. Who said this? Number one. I will read this sentence for you. We will meet Miss Varsha. Who said that? You remember the answer? Who said that? Dad. So here we are going to write D capital Dad. The answer is Dad. Who said Hello Renu? Who said that? You remember that? The firefighter. What's the name of that firefighter? We will write her name here. V capital. Varsha. Now let us come to the third sentence. I want to wear a yellow helmet. Who told? Did dad want to wear a yellow helmet? No. Varsha was already wearing yellow helmet. Then who said that? Whose name will come here? Here the answer will be Renu, our capital. Renu, Renu's name will come here. The next one, the last one, number four. Welcome to our fire station. Who said that? Who welcomed Renu to the fire station? It is none other than who is she? She is none other than Varsha. So we are going to write Varsha's name here. V capital A R S H A. Varsha. While doing this page, you can keep the book along with you so that you can write the spellings well. And once you are doing Remember to write today's date on the top left corner. What all we have done in today's class? In today's class we have read the story. We have read the left out words. That means we have completed the sentences. We have learned the words from vocabulary list 1. Their meaning as well as how they can be used in various sentences. And other than that we have done Two pages from Little Thinker English. I hope you all have enjoyed watching these three videos. Bye-bye. See you.